guys welcome back to another YouTube video so today I'm gonna show you how to survive in the storm in MSK forever without using any healing pads or cozy campfires so let's get started so what you want to have on your commander is Parasaur Jess because abilities heal for 21.5% of max health every time you use an ability now for your team perk what you want to have is Happy Holidays because this basically what it does is reduces your ability cooldown by 40% so that you'll be able to use your abilities more often while to heal you basically yeah and now for support team you will have Prestark Iza because she gives 33 armor to make you more unkillable when you're trying to survive in the storm you basically take less damage and then what you want is undercover buzz because she decreases gadget cooldown by 20 percent so that you can use your ad more often then what you want next is bomb squad kyle because he increases your armor by 22 to make you more unkillable and then next hero is flash ac because you want this flash AC to be in your support team because it will decrease your face shift cooldown by 25%. And now, last but not least, Fossil Selfie. Because Fossil Selfie is so good for this build is because you're using your abilities so much more often because of Happy Holidays, like your face shift. You want the energy regeneration so you can continue to keep on using it. And there's no need to have Blast from the Past team perk if you're having Fossil Selfie in the support team if you're going to take damage in the storm. Now for your gadgets, I normally run for my MSK, Slow Field, and the Joan Rush. Or if you ever wanted to try to solo MSK with Hover Turrets, the last part, go ahead. But, but the problem is the Storm King's health was healing when I tried that. So yeah, and then let's get started. Oh yeah, and one more thing you want to have is a ar full armor baron crafted. The perks are just pure armor on it. Doesn't matter about the last perk, but I just put attack speed there because that's what I thought was the best for. Now, we are going to go into the Mythic Storm game, and I'm going to show you how unkillable and unstoppable this build is to survive in the storm. One sec. Okay. So guys, I'm going to sit in the storm for 10 minutes just to show you she is Stand really on to assemble here. Protect home base. You can do this. Stay sharp. Anything can happen over there. Stand by to transport over to the other side. There's no need of having flash in the past. But because the reason why it's not flash in the past is because if you take a certain percentage damage in the storm, so that's why I don't use boss in the past. As you can see, 
Yeah, I'm only taking 22,000 damage about. Our scans in the KDS multiple weak spots. Shoot the weak spots! We're not just gonna fight this boss here. We're gonna show you. I can serve a lot. That's and that's basically it. See, as long as you keep on using your face set, and as long as you're holding your barracks, I'm gonna smash the building. Just in case. Alright, I think it's a good time to try to leave the move off now. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna try again. Yeah, this is perfect. <laughs> That's fun. And the storm should just go back to its original form.
on a whole box of pretzels. So. Guys, I think I'm gonna put an end to this video here. Thank you so much guys for watching. If you're new to this video, might as well if you enjoy my videos, please leave a like and subscribe for more. I will be posting more videos whenever I make up another idea. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.